told them in the uh, locker room, very proud of those two guys and what they've meant for our college and this community. They represent everything we want to be about here uh, with class. And obviously they're playing the floor is just second to none how tough and together they are. And that bleeds throughout our team. So couldn't be more thrilled for Storm and Trey. Obviously we think we're the number one seed. I wish we could play Sanford right now and have a shot at that, but uh, some things are out of your control. So we got to shift our eyes and all of our attention to the tournament, which we, uh, we feel pretty comfortable about. It was awesome, you know, super, super special night. Um, you know, I feel like I just went through uh, a moment that I'll, I'll uh, remember forever, you know. Big rivalry game at home with some, fines, some fans finally in here and family here, and to do it with a brother like Trey is awesome. And so, yeah, I mean, to get that win over one of our rival um, on senior night was super special. It's a lot of emotions, you know, me and Storm senior night. And we wanted to make it as special as possible. You know, uh, before the game, everyone's telling us how much they love us and how much they want to send us out in the right way. And I think this was a good start to that. Obviously, we got the conference tournament coming up, and we want to win as many games as we possibly can and go, and go to Indy and keep going as far as we can. But tonight was just a lot of emotions and a lot of love, and we ended up winning the way we wanted to. Um, all credit to Furman. They played, they played extremely hard today. And they gave us some troubles, honestly. And I think our message in the huddles was just keep fighting. Like, we're going to play hard. We're going to finish this game. And, like, a lot of, like, last year we got challenged to close out games, and that message was in this locker room going into this week, and that's what we had to do. We had to close out this game. Yeah, we got a resilient, tough bunch, and you're going to need that, right? We better pack our bags full of that in the tournament because things are going to go your way, and they're not going to go your way for stretches, calls, whatever the case may be. Uh, and tonight you could see some things were going against us a little bit, and our guys just dug their heels in, and I thought really showed that resiliency. We're going to need that. Uh, absolutely down in Asheville. And the uh, good thing is it's part of our DNA already. Second half, we came out um, on like a 10-0 run or something like that. And uh, I think that really, you know, gave us a lot of momentum. I know they started to come back as, you know, with Furman, it's always going to be a battle. But that gave us a lot of confidence and um, a couple huge stops we got, a couple huge shots we made, uh, big, big time plays um, from some other guys stepping up. Um, Messiah Jones was insane, you know. Morgan was awesome, um, great last bucket. so. Um, I think those were huge moments for us. I just think it goes into our preparation all week. Um, we knew like they was going to jump out a lot of shots and the coaches told them shot fake, try to get to the rim. And when shot fake again, once you get to the rim, and I just listened to my coaches and when my, when my number was called, I had to deliver. Starting tomorrow, just taking it one day at a time. You got to have uh, five, six great practices and we got to have one day at a time. If we win a game, we got to be ready to lock into the next game, film the same night. So it's one day at a time, we'll get us where we need to go, I think. We're going to need everybody, uh, coaches, managers, players. It's a collective deal with us. And uh, we're going to go down there and win three games. We better have everybody on board. So certainly guys had their pockets tonight where they made an impact and uh, some that the fans see and some that they don't. And uh, we certainly do that when we grade the film. And we just got a great team. I'm really proud of them, really uh, excited about next week and uh, how we can get better.